NFL regular season kicked off earlier tonight between the Dallas Cowboys and the reigning champs, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Florida A&M University Choir made history and performed Lift Every Voice and Sing live during the pregame ceremony. Just like last year, ahead of the national anthem, the league will play the song during the week one games and major events. But it seems like Megyn Kelly is fine with us coming together and celebrating America just as long as the black national anthem is not involved. Taking a page out of the shut up and dribble playbook, Kelly said she doesn't think the NFL should shove politics or divisive culture issues down the throats of viewers who are looking for a getaway. Really, Megan, a getaway? You want a league that is roughly 70% black to ignore the plights of their community, to turn a blind eye to the racial injustices, which started long before George Floyd and long before Colin Kaepernick take a knee because you're looking for a getaway? According to Media, Kelly went on to say, I don't think that the average American, black or white, wants to hear the black national anthem before they hear the national anthem, and that's no offense against people of color. Well, Megan, this person of color takes offense. And just to keep Miss Kelly's scorecard straight, no black Santa, no black national anthem, and no blackface. Oh, you know, well, that's a different story. I hope the NFL continues to lift every voice and sing even louder than the rolling seas for the tone deaf people in the back. I'm looking at you, Megan. More prime after the break.